This is Danielle Doyle with The Perfect Face and TPFCosmetics.com. And for those of you that don't know me, I have had this business for about 15 years. And over the past four years, I have had three little boys. So I have three right now under the age of four and still running a business. Um, life is crazy, life is busy, and there's never time to really get anything done. And I know a lot of you out there can totally relate to that. So I wanted to give you guys kind of a very quick um, five to ten minute busy mom makeover. This is something that will literally just get you out the door. Um, it's not something you you know wear to a red carpet event or even probably a date night with your honey. But it's great for the grocery store, great for running errands, great for the carpool lane so you don't look totally tired and like you haven't had coffee or sleep in weeks. So this will kind of wake you up a little bit and I hope you guys enjoy it. Okay guys, let's get started. So the first thing I did this morning was wash my face and I used CeraVe moisturizer. Um, I actually like three different types of moisturizer. I like the Image Skin Care Max Cream, which is really good. And then um, I love um, Embryo Lisse, but I also love CeraVe. It's, you can get it at the drugstore. Um, it has hyaluronic acid and it fills in fine lines, large pores. It's pretty awesome. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and get started and I'm gonna do it in real time without talking or really kind of showing the products and I can talk about them at the end. That way you guys can really see how long it actually takes. The first thing I'm using is our face canvas primer and I use one full pump all over the face. The next thing I'm gonna use is P2 Picture Perfect Foundation and I just pat that under the eyes and on the eyelids. It can be used for eyeshadow primer, concealer, and foundation if you're very fair. The next thing is cream puff powder and I just use that to lightly set on top of the foundation. I'm just using our fluff brush. Make sure you pat out any little lines first before you set it. This is actually our mineral makeup and the color I'm wearing today is Fawn. I'm using our large powder brush to just buff it into the skin. And you can see it goes on really, really fine but it does um, give a good amount of coverage. So all of the ruddiness, the little spider veins, the pink cheeks, all of that starts to just diminish. And it's very quick and easy. It also contains a sun protectant, which is great. And you can see it's just really simple to apply. Just buff it into the skin Make sure it just looks really even. And I always bring it down onto the neck. This is a Queen Shimmer Pigment, one of my favorite go-to colors for every day. It's just a buff nude color. This is medium contour and just very softly, very quickly brush that on right underneath the cheekbones. Also use that on the outside of the face, under the chin, around the temples, around the hairline, just to warm everything up. I'm also gonna use the medium contour right into my crease. So we are at three minutes and 31 seconds so far, guys. And all we have left are brows, lips, and lashes. Okay. 
Even if you're spending six minutes doing your makeup, always make sure it's very well blended. I probably spent more time on that than anything else. I'm going in with Morning Fog Eyeshadow to fill in my brows just using an angled brush. And I always fill in the beginning of the brow and the top of the arch and from the arch down to the tail end. And I distinctly dip into my product three times per brow. Again, following the top of the arch and then from the arch down to the tail end of the brow. And with what's left over on the brush, I'll just fill in the rest. My favorite mascara, as many of you know, is CoverGirl. So I'm just doing a quick coat of mascara. That's probably the one thing I would never leave the house without. A little bit on the bottom as well. I never realized I blink my mascara on until I started doing YouTube tutorials. <laughs> hey, but it works, right? I'm using my blush brush to apply a little blush. And here I'm using Cheeky. Keeping it really high on the cheekbones. I believe I'm using Cameo Liner here. But Sand works as well. Either one of those would look great with this look. And Shrimp Lipstick, which I love right now. It's a great everyday color. Let the hair down. Fluff it out. Carpool lane, I'm ready. Okay guys, so super simple. I think it took me about six and a half minutes. Um, you can definitely do this at home. A lot of it is just knowing your products um, and you know, kind of having them right there ready for you every morning. Um, I'll talk a little bit about the products at the end um, and I can list them below for you, but it was very, very simple. It's nothing extravagant. It kind of gets you out the door. It's great for the carpool. It's great for the grocery store. Um, not probably for a red carpet event, but you know, when you're a busy mom with three little boys and you're running a business, you got to just get out the door sometimes. So I hope you guys enjoyed my uh, very busy mom quick makeover and make sure you follow us on Facebook backslash TPF Cosmetics, Periscope, Twitter, and Instagram at The Perfect Face. You can find all of the products at tpfcosmetics.com and you can also visit us at theperfectface.com. Thank you guys so much for watching and have a blessed day. So the first thing that I used was our face canvas primer. That's this one. And it fills in fine lines, large pores. It just helps your foundation go on smoother and last a little bit longer. And then the next thing I did was our P2 Picture Perfect Foundation. I use this as my concealer, highlighter, and eyeshadow base. And I just use my ring finger to pat it underneath the eye, up the cheekbone, down the side of the nose, and on the lid. Um, then I went in and I set that with Cream Puff Loose Powder. And I just used a little fluff brush, just to kind of dust that on. I do kind of give good pressure though, so it doesn't find its way into little fine lines later. The next thing that I did was I used our mineral makeup. I don't recommend this for stage of photography because it does have SPF 30, um, but for the everyday woman, it is great. It 
basically um, evens out your skin tone. It's really simple, it's really light. I just used our large powder brush, kind of dust it in there and then buff it into the skin. And then I went in with our Queen Shimmer Pigment because that will kind of like open up the eyes, wake you up a little bit. And I used our large shadow brush to pat that on with this little guy. And I just patted that right onto the lid. I went in next with our medium contour. This one with a blush brush right underneath the cheekbone, kind of brushed it up. And then that same color I used for my crease just to add a little bit of depth. Then I went in and did my brows using the angled brush and morning fog eyeshadow and just filled them in a little bit. It's great for medium to dark brown hair. Then we went in with some blush. This one is cheeky. It looks really bright. If that's cheeky, it's kind of a peachy um, kind of coral color. You can see it really well there right across the cheekbones. I don't like putting on the apples of the cheeks. I feel like it rounds out the face, so I bring it up onto the cheekbone. And then next, um, I believe I might have done lashes next. And I love CoverGirl mascara. This one happens to be a full lash bloom. I love all of them. Um, my favorite one is actually called their Lash Perfection. It's really hard to find though. That's my favorite. And then I used Cameo Lip Liner. I overline my lips, I like them to look a little bit fuller. And then our newest lipstick is Shrimp. This one actually came out today, but I love this color. Did the lips, and then that is it.